Hey everybody, it's Zach from My Shire Farm. We are back again to try to help you on your journey with Caternix quail and becoming more self-sufficient. In this video, we are discussing candling, how to candle and when to candle. Now this playlist is called the hatching process. The first couple of videos, we talked about receiving the eggs in. We also talked about temperature, humidity, and when to put them in. Now, today is day 15. That's when we recommend you moving them over to lockdown. So the morning of the 15th day is when you're going to change from incubator to lockdown. The main two things are number one, they no longer turn, and number two, the humidity changes. Now, if you want a candle, this is the best opportunity to do it because you've already got to be moving the eggs. So try not to move eggs or open the incubator at all until day 15. So what we use is an Incubrite. This is the candler we use. You can get it on Amazon or eBay. Uh, we've tried a couple different candlers. This one is absolutely the best. So I'm going to turn the lights off, turn the incubator off, uh, and then I'm going to candle a couple and show you the difference between a fertile and an infertile egg. Now, in our incubator, we have an actual incubator, and then right here, we have an actual lockdown that we transfer them over. Most people are going to use the incubator as an incubator and a lockdown. So all you're gonna wanna do is pull them out of the tray or the, the turner, uh, candle them, and then lay them flat on the incubator, and then raise the humidity, and you're good to go, okay? So I'm going to turn the lights off. We're going to grab a couple of eggs here. And hopefully I will be able to show you the difference between a fertile and an infertile egg. This one here is fertile. Can't see through it. This one here. is also fertile. You can kind of see the air sac at the top. This one, fertile as well. This one is infertile, so it is completely see-through. Okay, so this one you would just toss, and then the other three you would just put right into lockdown. Okay, uh, so that's when you should be candling. That's how you candle. We recommend the Incubrite. We like that one the most. Um, and then uh, you'll just lay them flat on the incubator. Stay tuned because the next video, chicks are hatching, and we're going to show you what you need to do on day one. So stay tuned. Check us out on our website, and remember, every Sunday at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, we go live right here on our YouTube channel to answer any questions that you might have that I have not answered. Good luck. Stay safe. We'll see you then. Thanks.